TV time. What else to say? Old man, take a stroll down into the Reaper Tunnel. Now, why would he go down there? I'll tell you why, because he's one of them. He's the reason they've been able to spread their terror all across our city. We stop him, we stop the Reapers. Simple as that. Uh, newsflash, the Reapers have already been stopped. Quite a few episodes ago, actually. Anyways, hi guys, this is Guy Christian 9 with Let's Play Infamous. In the last episode, we dealt with a bunch of buses. That's pretty much it. <laughs> <laughs> Very simple. Also, don't want to get run over by a train. But, uh, yeah. This episode was supposed to start in front of the mission. Unfortunately, TV time happened, so... We got a little bit of a downtime before we actually get to it. But this mission is going to be one doozy of a mission. And it's probably one of the more entertaining ones as well. So I'm actually kind of looking forward to it. Unfortunately, it's all the way on the other side of this island, but, um, anyways. I'm not gonna blow you up this time, and there are no deathsmen around, so they can't blow you up. Because <laughs> some of you have been noting how the, the shockingly lar uh, like, shockingly high frequency of exploding gas stations lately. Also, get away! Yeah. <laughs> I like how you soccer kick these things. Fun. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. I'm at the prison, Moya. The dust men are going to hit it with everything they've got, and the extraction team is still 20 miles away. Do whatever it takes to keep Alden secure. Oh, I thought you guys were gonna g go. Yeah. I was hoping these guys were gonna despawn. Oh, now you run away. Jeez. Alright, well, let's get into this, um, prison here. We're going the long way around. Well, technically short way. Well, technically long-ish short way. Um, well, anyways. Uh, I don't think we're supposed to get on here because the dots say we gotta go down. Oh yeah, we're supposed to talk to Zeke to first. Some lobs to a more secure area of the prison. You gotta hold off the trash baggers while they make the move. What the hell is a lop? A prisoner, man. You know, a shank holder. Come on, give it the lingo. <laughs> shank holder. Oh, and check it out. That walkway up there is cracking with juice. Little thing I whipped up. Wow, thanks. Ain't damn right. Alright, so, this is why this mission's fine. Keep those things off us, Cole. Alright, so the first stage, basically, there's gonna be a bunch of these little cannonballs coming over. And once the status pops up, now we have to start defending it with Shockwave. And since we're on an electrified platform, you have infinite energy to Shockwave with. I suppose having the upgrade for Shockwave would actually make this a lot easier because I believe the second upgrade for Shockwave it made the um, thing bigger? I think that's what the second one was. And I think that's the same with uh, both uh, good and evil side, too, so... But yeah, it starts off simple enough. Now I got two. Ooh. I got both of them at once. Oh, this could be bad. Yeah. Alright, so nothing too challenging so far. The cars is just kind of in the way. Alright, all done. Now the fun part comes out. Oh, hell. Seek, get out of here. Run. There's no way, man. My gun's a lot loaded. These guys will kill you. Go help the cops lock down all of As you can see, I'm having a lot of fun with grenades. <laughs> I even got a new stun too, crowd control, which is exactly what this is titled. But as you can see, with infinite energy. Oh shoot. Well, anyways, I think I still got. No, my electricity's going down. I thought I had infinite energy. Ow. Uh, I don't know what the point of interest is at. Uh, 
I thought these things were supposed to stay electrified. That's not good. Alright, well, let's just deal with lightning bolts, I guess. Because, yeah, it doesn't look like all, any of this is electrified anymore. Well, that sucks. Hopefully none of those, uh, things hit me. Okay, let's go over here. Oh no, I thought that said 20 XP for a second there. Alright, quite a few. It's got golem now, so that's bad. bad Alright, let's just hit it a little bit. Oh, I think I'm electrified again! Because I'm starting to get energy back. And his conduit defeated. Enemy officer defeated. Also, I don't know where I was getting energy there. Because this gate's still de electrified. Crap on a stick. Trash baggers killed the power. We need to restart the generators on the roof before all the wakes up. Alright, so at this point, now we're supposed to climb the um, prison. So, luckily, if you've um, climbed it before during that one sub mission or side mission, you kind of have a helpful guide of where to go. Sort of. But, uh, yeah, this is a stage three, I guess. Also, there are more guys up here. Alright, one melee. The other two are going down with electricity. Hey, you're just going downtown. <laughs> Although, you didn't die. When did she die? Alright, uh, I think I'm supposed to go up there. Bye. Okay, I can't stand. Alright, good. Oh, shoot. Okay. Whew, I thought that was a, a pit there for a second. Now, I don't believe you're... I don't know if you're timed at this part or not. I've never failed it personally, so... But, uh... Anyways. Also, be careful because those concrete um, uh, platforms will fall apart. There we go. Alright, so a bunch of careful platforming here. Also, blast shard! Man, we still have a lot of blast shards in order to get the next battery port. Like, the... It just starts scaling ridiculously high up. Also, those things are snapping before I even hit them. Alright, we're up here. I hear a dead drop. Can't get up here. No, I can't. Uh, alright, Blue Dot says it's here. Oh, here he is. There we go. Alright, alright, if I can figure out how to get back to the yard. There we go. Let's get rid of you two guys along the way. I think the blue dot. Oh! Okay. Rude. I might die. I don't think there are any more. Oh, nope, there's one. Oh, there's two. Well, three, technically. I wasn't counting these guys. Alright, uh... There we go. I thought there was a guy here. Oh, I guess there was! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't even see him. Um, Alright, zap you, and then head down to this blue dot.
I think I'm supposed to hit here. Yeah, this is electrified. Alright, so stage four. It's essentially the same as stage two. Just go to town on those shock grenades. We're even getting enviro takedowns. Also be careful because some of them will sneak up over on the corner there. Alright, what am I doing? Now this can get even more entertaining if you have the evil side version of the shock grenade because uh, evil shock grenades will actually scatter into a bunch of mini grenades. Um, upgrades will go from three grenades to five grenades to seven grenades. And this, each of the mini grenades has the uh, same power as a regular one un upgraded grenade. Good, gr good grenade. So basically, you just if you're an evil person, you can just like just spam those things and just go crazy. Like just explosions everywhere. But uh, let's let's take care of this golem guy and uh, let's clear the crowd a little bit. All right, this guy's almost dead. Come on, got to be close. There we go. All right, distance. So let's Extraction throw a few grenades. Really there. ETA, four minutes. How long does it take to go twenty miles? Pretty sure she said 20 miles, or did she say 20 minutes? I don't know. Oh Jesus, another golem. Alright, start spamming grenades. See if we can, or spam it. Uh, let's spam the megawatt hammer as hell. Okay, this is gonna be a little bit tense. Oh, I don't know what he said, but... Alright, come on. There we go. Also, the other one got stuck. <laughs> Alright. More megawatt hammers! Ow. Why are your hands still there? There. I'm getting wounded kills. <laughs> I don't know where those people are coming from. Alright, both of your arms are down. Lost some time there. Okay, there we go. Ow. What the hell are you doing, Zeke? I told you to stay with Alden. How that old man ain't going nowhere? They got him dressed up like a spring goose. By the time I got inside, it was too late. The place was slick with gore. Poor bastards never got any backup. If Zeke kept his post, they'd be alive now. And Alden would still be in a cage. Not sure Zeke's ever gonna forgive himself for this. Don't know that he should. That night, we could hear the screams from Tent City. They were drunk on power. Proud of their victory over the cops. And over me. Now the race sphere seems farther away than ever. Alden knows we're coming. He'll prepare. So yeah, despite all of that, we still lose. Kinda sucks. <laughs> also, look at this view. WHAT?! HOW AM I EVIL?! Okay. Where the hell have you been, Cole? I've been trying to reach you. Yeah, bless her. Alden's cool. gone, Moya. Transients busted him out and killed every cop in the prison. This is unacceptable, Cole. You had explicit orders to keep him there. What the hell happened? Look, don't lay this on me. I did everything I could. Zeke is the one who blew it. I told him to stay back and help the cops, but he wouldn't listen. It's time to cut him loose, Cole. He's become a liability, and we have no margin for error, especially with Alden back on the streets. I'm gonna make a run on the next substation and beat the hell out of some bad guys. 
That should brighten up my day. <laughs> At least that's what I'm thinking he's thinking. Um, but anyways, the next mission is going to be all the way up there, so that's going to be the final substation, light in the tunnel. And we'll be doing that in the next episode of Let's Play Infamous. I'll see you guys then.